55-year-old David Alperin was diagnosed with throat cancer. Until coming here to UCLA, some of the proposed treatment options from his other doctors seemed worse than the diagnosis itself. He described a procedure where your face is split in half and they go in and it's basically reconstructive surgery and I just, I kind of tuned out at that point. A right-sided throat tumor right at the level of his tonsil. David's cancer turned out to be a tumor in the area of his tonsil. After careful examination and imaging at UCLA, head and neck surgeon Dr. A.B. Mendelson determined that the tumor was not attached to other vital structures, making him a perfect candidate for a new procedure called TORS. Transoral robotic surgery is, is a revolutionary approach two throat tumors in particular, trans meaning through, oral meaning mouth, through the mouth, robotic, using the robotic system, surgery. We wanted to offer him a surgery to remove that tumor and allow him to be cancer free. Everything goes through the mouth uh, like a dental procedure. With Dr. Mendelssohn at the controls about 15 feet away, the endoscopic camera and other robotically controlled instruments are guided precisely to the region of the tumor, all directly through the mouth. What used to be a very gruesome, very debilitating surgery can now be done only taking out what we absolutely have to. Any tumor that can be removed surgically should be considered for transoral robotic surgery. And we are looking at patients with stage one, two, three, and even stage four tumors. As with this more recent TORS procedure performed by Dr. Mendelssohn on another successful cancer patient, David's throat cancer was completely removed, and David is now cancer free. As excited as I am, I keep in the back of my mind always that it could be there, so I try not to get too cocky or too excited that I quote unquote beat cancer, but I think I did. And my hopes are just to watch my kids grow up, enjoy my family, and continue to enjoy life because there's no side effects at this point.